G'day folks, Scoop Cakes here. I've uh, had my first fly away on my quad the other day. Uh, basically, long story short, don't fly around high voltage power lines, otherwise it'll upset your quad and it will fly away. <laughs> so uh, I went ahead and I bought one of these B-found, um, Turnergy B-found beepers which you can get from Hobby King for about four bucks. And I thought I'd plug it in because it would help me find my quad, which took me about an hour to find. <laughs> and uh, lo and behold, I plugged it in and the thing wouldn't work. And I thought, oh, damn, I've wasted my money, all four dollars. So I got on the forums, had a look, and everyone seemed to say, these don't work with you know, Spectrum... Um, receivers or any of those digital receivers and basically buy something else so I persisted and played around with it and I found that I could actually get it to work and I'm using a, an old Spectrum AR7000 and this is a, a version 1 um, version 1's have the bind port um, it's only a bind port battery port uh, version 2's that bind port battery port can also use be for data, their data logger, which I've never had any uh, experience with. So anyway, I found that by plugging in the Turner GB found into that bind port, it works as uh, it works as advertised, and I'm just going to show you that working right now. So I turn on my transmitter. We will plug in a battery. Bear with. Okay, so we got a beep. Sorry about that. We got a beep when we first turned it on. And as you see, my transmitter is on. And I'm going to turn it off. And she starts beeping. It's not that loud. Um, but certainly it's going to be better than nothing if you lose your quad. And let's turn on the transmitter. And presto! It works. So there you go. If you've got an AR7000, I'm not sure how it works with the newer DM DSMX receivers or any of those other uh, high-tech receivers, but certainly for the AR7000, it does work. Ta-da! Thanks for watching.